All right. It's time for chaos. I've decided that that is going to be the name of this show since we are doing Planar Chaos Commander. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. I got four more cards for Sophie's deck. I didn't even say that this was the first episode of Chaos, but this will be the first episode. I got four more cards for Sophie's deck. Vito, Thorn of the Dusk Rose. I love this card. Uh, whenever you gain life, target opponent loses that much life. You can pay three plus two black and give creatures you control life link until the end of the turn. Boom. Uh, the Mirror Matrix. Mirror Matrix is indestructible. All mirrors get plus one, plus one. You can pay five and put a one, one mirror artifact creature token into play. Boom. I love it. The Mind Servant uh, lets you shuffle your library if you pay two. That'll be good. Uh, and then the Custodian. When Mirror Custodian enters the battlefield, scry two. Then each opponent may scry one. Uh, to scry. Okay, yeah, I got that part. Sweet. Boom. I don't know why that one. This deck has changed so much since I, I don't know. The first list I made, I might change it back. I don't know. But it's got Will the Wise and Dustin the Gadget Master. Um, so it has all the swords in it. I have two more cards I need to get for this set. Or for this deck. I need to get the Pride Soul Ring. Okay, I have three. Uh, Exquisite Blood and the Sword of Forge and Frontier, I think. But it's got... It's changed a little bit since I originally wrote the list. But it has all the cards in it that let you do... Why can't I think of it? Extort. It extorts and does other cool things with Mir. All right. Planar Chaos. I was hoping to get all three of the Doctor Who sets that I need. But Timey Wimey, the set that has 10, 11, and 12, is $95. So I was only able to get the 13th Doctor set. And the Masters of Evil, the bad guy set. So let's crack into open these. But it's okay. I am going to an event at Oasis Games in Salt Lake on January 13th. At which time... I will be able to get the other set. Ah, yes. The Planar Chaos cards. And the uh, enticement, whatever you want to call it. It would be nice if I got a canine. I'm going to need one of those. I didn't. I got... Sarah Jane Smith, and as told, as foretold. I got that last time when I opened my first deck. I will need Sarah Jane. I don't think I need as foretold yet. And if I remember right, it's a $6 card. I don't need any of this other special crap. But I do need... Why is this so difficult right now? The box to carry your deck. Your deck and life counter. Boom. And your deck. And then, oh, this one doesn't have a box. Or I totally just destroyed it already. No. This one didn't come with, wait, I'm pretty sure the other one didn't either. Never mind. I don't know what I'm thinking. Planar Chaos Dice. 
All right, that is the 13th Doctor. And the companion, wait, it doesn't show who her companion is. We'll open this up. Oh man, I should put a link. I found this cool deck holder case that is a TARDIS. It holds the commander deck, and I don't know how many dice it holds in the tray underneath, but it holds. I don't need to learn how to play, and I know the steps for my turn. But there is the commander card, and I... Oh, I do need the 13th Doctor for the deck that lets you... Yasmin Khan. She's a detective? It doesn't say... It does say Doctor's Companion, so there we go. Lots of blue. I like it. I'm pretty sure this is the deck that has, except it looks like I just passed all the red. Maybe it's Timey Wimey. Timey Wimey has the Vincent Van Gogh card from Vincent and the Doctor's episode. Cool. I'm excited about this. All right, so there's the 13th Doctor. And we'll build her case really fast, so I have somewhere to put her. If I remember where her box went. It's really easy to build. It's really not... All right. So we'll put those in there for now. I need to buy sleeves for her. And we'll put her right there for a minute. And then we'll go and open. These. Uh. Let's see here. The Doctor's Childhood Barn. Storm Cage. Containment Facility. The Drum Mining Facility. Singling Tower of Darum. Flex point, a fixed point in time. When you encounter a fixed point in time, until your next turn, if a player would planeswalk as a result of rolling the planar die, chaos ensues instead. I like it. Uh, besieged Viking Village, North Pole Research Base, Temple of Atropos, Kerblam Warehouse. And the dining car. I don't think we're going to be able to get all 40 in this black envelope. But you know what? We're going to try. I also think that with 20, it's going to be tough. With 20 planar chaos cards, we might do an episode before the last doctor. There also can't be 20 in each set if there's only... Oh, I already have. So this, yeah, never mind. I can't math on my days off. I can't math on my days on either. All right, here we go. Bust open our enticement cards. I should go buy more. This is how it ends. Target creatures, target creatures owner shuffles it into their library then faces a vicious villainous choice they lose five life or they shuffle another creature they own into their library nice and the master manipulator legendary creature time lord rogue Marriott. cool i will see about those Planer dice. Oh, that's the other planer dice. Alright. Trash. I need to take my trash out now. Get the box. Life counter. Garbage. The deck. And the die. 
I do want to get all of the Planar Chaos cards because that would be insane and well, it would be chaotic and that's great. And I have a list. That is my Mindlock Fairy deck. I thought about buying some today while I was at the store, but I have a list. And counting the Doctor Who cards, there are 125 Planar Chaos cards. I will be able to cut down my list because I only have one more Doctor Who deck to buy. But when I made the list, I wasn't planning on buying all of these. I should have, because I can... Come on, it's Doctor Who, and I love Doctor Who. The... Oh man, it's a good thing I went to the game store today, because I learned that they oracled all of the companions. So now... To get them out of the command field, you have to pay three, and then it goes to your hand. So, yes. Darvis Darlock Creator. Keep that one, and put that one in my two-cell pile, because I don't need him. Perfect. Missy. Oh, I'm excited about this. Darlock. Perfect. Put him in here. Put him in here. Put his life token in here. Yep. Because it fits. Cool. It doesn't fit in here when it has sleeves, but that's all right. And then we'll crack open our stuff. City of the Dalloks. The moon base. I love the moon base. When you roll, uh, all creatures have pay two. This creature gains flying until the end of turn. Uh, the Dalok Intensive Care. Bowie Base 1. The Doctor's Tomb. Alpine Matorium. Unleash the Flux. The Matrix of Time. Ho Hotel of Fears. Mondasin Colony Ship. Sweet. Where is my... There it is. Boom. Yeah, it, it might fit 40. I think that would, that's all it would be able to fit. But, but it has 30 in it now. And it's holding up strong. All right. Thank you for joining me on this episode of Chaos.